We introduced you to the new director of the Kansas Bureau of Investigation's Forensic Labs. But how do those labs help students hoping to make a living out of solving crime? KSMT News reporter Austin Barnes toured the Topeka KBI lab to find out. He joins us live tonight with the answer. Brooke, a hands-on approach. That's the uh, steps they take here on the Washburn campus to teach students how to fight crime. Now, thankfully for them, they've got this KBI crime lab housed right here on campus, making it easier than ever before to pursue a career in forensic science. It all starts in a lab like this one. Evidence items ranging from murder weapons to cell phones are collected and processed by forensic scientists. But it's with the help of a former KBI scientist that the future generation of lab technicians is being groomed at Washburn University. My practical experience has allowed me to set up all of their labs as if they were real case evidence. So, so they are getting a lot of real world experience. Holly O'Neill served the KBI for years before taking over Washburn's forensic science program. She says collaboration with the KBI helps set the program apart and allows her students to get hands on with projects like drug analysis. My students usually stay over time in the lab. They are so excited about having the replicate instrumentation that they'll use in their futures that they're very um, eager to, to keep it analyzing and, you know, overachieving. The KBI lab housed on the school's campus was built with efficiency in mind for both students and acting forensic scientists. Take a look at this classroom. It may look normal, but just on the other side of a wall lies this garage, used to get a closer look at cars involved in crimes. Everything that we walk through and we talk about today and, and in the next 20 years was built with forensic science in mind. So the processing of evidence items, uh, how they interrelate and work themselves through a building like this in the various sections. The KBI's newly appointed Director of Forensic Science Labs, T.L. Price, is a graduate of the Washburn program. In the role, Price says he'll make sure everyone who uses the lab is provided with proper support to get any job done. Now, we had hoped to talk with a couple of students today about their experience with the program, but they were busy taking finals. It's that time of year, so they were preoccupied. Now, when it comes time for those students to complete their labs, we're told they walk in on mock cases set completely up, just like they would uh, be if they were to find a real crime scene, helping them to do the work of real KBI investigators and be completely prepared once they enter the field. Reporting live at Washburn University tonight, Austin Barnes, KSNT News. Thank you, Austin. We've learned Washburn students work with the Criminal Justice Department in addition to the KBI. The program's director says it's just another collaborative element that keeps the program practical.